Okay, let's take a look at the next 10 from the same test. This is SAC 2012. Number 11 is where we're at. So let's take a look at number 11. It says 48 is 16 percent of what? So 48 equals 16 over 100 times what? So I'm going to divide by 16 percent. 48 divided by 16 is 3, and then percent is 100, so that's 300. 42 times 48 is an interesting problem. Notice that the 1's add up to 10, 2 plus 8, and your 10th digit is the same. Whenever you have that, you have a specific shortcut for that. 2 times 8 is 16, and then you add 1 to this 4, so you have 4 times 5 is 20, so that's 2016. Greatest common divisor for 51 and 85. The difference there is 34. And 34 doesn't go into either, though, the, either one of those, but factors of 34 will. 17 in this case. 17 times 3 and 17 times 5, so 17 is your answer. Number 14, you have 35 plus 30 times 25 divided by 15 minus 10. I would look at these two right here, these three numbers, because the order of operations says we're going to multiply and divide first before we can add or subtract. So I'm going to have 30 divided by 15. That's 2 times 5. That's 50. So I have 50 minus 10. That's 40. 40 plus 35. That's 75. Number 15, you want a Roman numeral converted to Arabic number. M is 1,000, so write 1,000. C is 100. And then 2 is just 2. That's 1102. We want to convert pounds to ounces, 16 ounces per pound. So I'm going to multiply this times 16. 20 times 16 is 320. So I'll write a 3. And then 20 plus 12 is 32. Which is larger, 11 fifteenths or 9 thirteenths? Well, if I do a cross product here, 11 times 13, this is 143. And if I do a cross product here, 15 times 9, that's 135. The larger one of those two would be the 143, which is represented by 1115 here. And now I need to go over to the top of the next column. So I'm going to scroll up a little bit. And number 20, I'm going to go up to number 20 today. Uh, number 18 says the sum of the prime factors of 110, prime divisors, well, 110 is 2 times 55. And 55 is 5 plus 11. So all I have to do is multiply those. I have to add 2, 5, and 11. What do you get? 7 plus 11, that's 18. The mean of 1, 3, 6, 10, and 15. These are triangular numbers. And so if I add those together, I'm going to have 1 plus 2 is 4, plus 6 is 10, 20, 35, divided by 5, that's 7. Uh, 200 times, this is an approximation. Number 20 is the start problem, it's an approximation. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do 200 times 210, and I'm going to add 2,000 since it's an approximation. And what I'm doing is I'm going to multiply 200 times 210. I notice there's two zeros here and one there. I'm going to write three zeros to begin with. Then I'm going to have 2 times 21, that's 42,000 plus 2,000, that's 44,000. And that would be the first 20 problems. We'll pause right there.